Hello everyone, my name is Wei Hao Cui. Uh, I'm now a PhD student in Shanghai Jiao Tong University. I'm here to today to present our latest work on optimizing dynamic neural networks. This work is done when I'm a research intern in Microsoft Research Asia. Uh, across the years, their models are growing larger and more complex. It is challenging to deploy these models either in the cloud or edge. Uh, to address this challenge, dynamic neural networks uh, appear to uh, be a, a promising choice because they choose many favorable properties such as computing efficiency, adaptiveness, generality, and interpretable model definition. For example, GPT-4 might use a dynamic neural network called uh, MOE. <coughs> now let me show some examples about dynamic neural networks. Basically, in dynamic neural network, Values in input tensors are dynamically routed uh, with the help of control flow. The first dynamic, uh, dynamic model is MOE-based model here. The, the tokens of a language sequence or the whole sequences are routed to different experts for processing. It is the most common seen in dynamic models. The second example is a model for the adaptive super-resolution. It contains multiple super-resolution modules. The whole image is first split into multiple sub-images here, aka patches. Because the complexity of these patches can vary much, much, they are routed to different modules. For instance, some patches only contain background. Their complexity is low, so they are routed to the simple module for processing. And others with higher complexity, for example, the cast face, are routed to the medium or the hard module for processing. The last one is the uh, using temporal results in video tasks. Most values in tensors for the adjacent video frames are the same. Therefore, only the part with different values need to be routed for processing. Others can be directly uh, reused. In order to optimize these dynamic neural networks, we try to uh, first learn from dynamic optimizations in traditional programming languages like Java. These compilers uh, can support just in time optimizations for control flow. For example, code reordering, splitting and removal, switch analysis, and some speculative optimizations. Uh, these language compilers are collecting runtime statistics to, and analyzing them for optimization. However, we found out, uh, found out that for dynamic neural networks, the tensor centric programming in the existing frameworks like PyTorch hinders similar uh, dynamic optimizations. Tensor level programming in existing frameworks only expresses the relation of tensors and operators. For example, frameworks uh, treat the whole sequence, the whole image as a single tensor. However, the dynamism of dynamic models often exists at, uh, at sub-tensor level. There is a misalignment between tensor level programming and subtensor level dynamism. Therefore, we propose brainstorm to mitigate these gaps. The goals of brainstorm are as follows. First, we need to collect the statics of dynamism at the right level. Second, we need to decouple the model dynamic expression from optimization. Finally, we need to enable dynamic optimizations for dynamic models. Uh, in order to achieve these goals, Brainstorm first proposes several key abstractions to enable dynamic optimizations. The first abstraction is cell. It is the basic unit to be routed. We provide uh, an, an API to annotate a tensor with the dimensions and the shapes. Then, at runtime, Brainstorm can identify the cells as the routing granularity. Furthermore, a router is proposed to dispatch cells inside the uh, single tensor to different branches. Router is a special DN operator that can adapt to uh, different dynamic optimizations. Its definition accepts a router function to support customized uh, routing rules. For example, top one. The output uh, of router function is simply a tensor called routes. It specifies the destination for each cell. Now I will show how we define the three previous dynamic models with the proposed abstractions. Take a moment as a, uh, an example. In MOE, uh, each token is a cell. 
Therefore, we use the uh, we first use the annotator and API to specify the token of the cell. <clears throat> then router function computes destination for all accepted uh, cells. Assuming there are two experts here, uh, the route tensor specifies that the first and the third cells are routed to the expert zero. The second one is routed to the expert one. And then router dispatches them to uh, these cells to different experts accordingly. Other two examples are similar. Now, there is still one question remaining unresolved. How to trace the runtime statics, for example, cell, uh, cell relationships, and analyze them for optimization? Obviously, the output of router function contains the cell relationships across the router. Brainstorm uses a GIT profiler to collect these runtime profilers, profi profiles for optimizations. However, Brainstorm also wants to propose some dynamic optimizations between adjacent routers. So it is necessary for Brainstorm to extract the sales relationship across some static layers. Brainstorm relies on existing solutions called symbolic execution for static tracing. Due to time limit, I uh, please refer uh, to the paper for details about uh, static tracing. Now, Brainstorm can optimize the dynamic neural networks. Its system architecture is as shown in the figure. First, uh, researchers need to program with cell and router. Brainstorm then can trace and analyze the cell level data flow statically and dynamically. Finally, Brainstorm will perform dynamic optimizations based on the profiled data. Now I will use uh, we will use Brainstorm to provide dynamic neural networks and optimize them. Here we realize the statics of four common scene dynamic models. They are collected by running the models on, spe on specific data sets. The switch transformer and task MOE are two uh, MOE-based dynamic models. Live SR here uh, is a dynamic super resolution models. Dynamic routing is a dynamic, um, uh, dynamic neural network uh, for uh, computer vision. From now on, I will talk about several optimizations propo uh, proposed by Brainstorm one by one. Uh, the, uh, all the optimization strategies are enabled by Brainstorm according to these runtime profiles. First, let's start from the top two figures. These figures show the number of tokens routed to experts and the number of patches routed to branches. As shown in the figure, the loads of branches are imbalanced but stable. In this case, we can tune GPU kernels with specific uh, shapes. Meanwhile, these branches can <coughs> commonly can be paralleled. We can fuse them, for, uh, fuse them horizontally for higher utilization. Therefore, we propose dynamic op horizontal fusion. There may be mismatch between the actual shape and the tuned one. Brainstorm's router will dynamically match, uh, map them to the most close one. It also uh, passes the tensors automatically at runtime. We evaluate dynamic horizontal fusion with switch transformer. The test bed is a server with single Ampere 100 GPU. We compare Brainstorm with to, uh, Tosh and Tutel. Tutel fuses branches with batch map more. Thus, it needs massive padding and can lead to out of memory error. Compared with Torch, Brainstorm achieves up to 3.6 times speed up. Task MOE, routes the, uh, <coughs> Task MOE routes the sequences to different experts for processing. The bottom left figure shows the correlated activation between adjacent expert layers in Task MOE. As shown in the figure, most of the sequences routed to the first expert of layer zero are then routed to the 14th and 15th experts of layer one. There exists, uh, there exists a strong correlation between adjacent routers in task MOE. Meanwhile, MOE models like task MOE need to be processed with multiple GPUs to, due to large model size. In this case, we can deploy the correlated paths on the same GPU. It can save inter-GPU communication. Uh, in Modi, uh, <coughs> therefore, we propose profile-guided model parallel mode for uh, models like Task MOE. Assuming the profile shows that the 19% cells are routed between GPU 0 and GPU 1, 
Brainstorm then places the branches with higher correlated probabil uh, prob probability on the same GPU. This means that in the optimal placement, only 10 percentage cells are routed between GPUs. Others are only memory copy on local GPU. <coughs> we evaluate a profile guided model placement with MOE. Uh, with task MOE, the test bed is a server with 8 Volta 100 GPUs. Brainstorm first brings up to 1.17 times speed up with efficient sparse communication. Brainstorm further achieves up to 1.34 times speed up with th the optimized placement. The last figure shows the branch activation of dynamic routing. Although branches are designed to be dynamically activated on specific data sets, some branches are always active and some branches are never active. Based on the bias, the runtime routing, we can speculate to skip some routing for acceleration. Moreover, when GPU memory is constrained, we can also speculatively preload the weight. Take speculative routing as an example for speculative optimizations. By default, a router is first executed and the branches are activated by the output of the router. If there is a biased activation, for example, branch zero is activated with high probability. Brainstorm then predicts to skip the execution of router and directly activate the branch zero. However, Brainstorm may, pre may mispredict the router's output. In this case, Brainstorm also need to unroll and relaunch the correct uh, branch. We evaluate the speculative routing with the MSDNet. Brainstorm first brings up to eight times speed up with uh, speculative routing. We also apply dynamic horizontal fusion on MSNet. Overall, Brainstorm achieves up to 11 times speed up. <coughs> For more experiments on dynamic optimization and efficient uh, implementations of Brainstorm, please refer to our paper. In this paper, we identify the new optimization space towards statistically profiles for dynamic models. We also identify that the major challenge to, for enabling the dynamic optimization is the misalignment between tensor level programming and sub tensor level profiling. With these insights in mind, Brainstorm is proposed for optimizing dynamic models with profiled statistics. Brainstorm first unifies the programming model with cell and router. With these abstractions, Brainstorm enables the sub tensor level dynamism tracing. Furthermore, Brainstorm proposes effective optimization strategies. That's all, thanks. <laughs>